Previously on OMG, we bought a house. We are starting demolition today. This has like been so long in the making. Practice our own contractors on this project. This is such a big moment. I'm so excited to be rid of this thing. Well, what happens if I have to go at some point today? I can't go in that. It's just a porta potty. All right, so we'll go pick up the tile tomorrow. Good to be. Really? Can't wait to decorate. There's so much we can make. How will it turn out? OMG, we bought a house. Okay, door. Coming! We're Where back! Are we? Oh my gosh, you guys, thank you so much for the warm, warm reception of season three. We're so happy to be back with OMG, we bought a house. Last week, we tore out a bunch of stuff. Yes. And now it's time to put some stuff back in. Yes, I told Joey how to rip stuff out, and now. <laughs> Today I'm gonna pick out everything and install it all myself. With my tutelage. Make sure and subscribe. Try to get a million subscribers by the end of the year. Who's gonna be the $10,000 subscriber winner if we hit those 1 million subscribers? And also, don't forget, with every 100,000 additional subscribers we get, we will be donating $1,000 to charities that help find homes for people in need. So, I mean, it's all worth it. And watch us get some tile. Let's tile it up. Tile and style. Let's go. Joey! Wow. Oh my god, this is hexagon. This is what I want for the kitchen floors. This is real, like marble. This is expensive. The original bathroom, we have those little tiny mosaic hexagons. Uh -huh. I want to like honor that. The tile is the biggest part of the renovation that we're doing because this is really where we're establishing the pattern, the tone. I found a place, Rock Mill Tile and Stone in Los Angeles. They have exactly what Kate's looking for. We have a hard deadline. My mom's coming to town with my two little nephews. Right now, we don't even have a guest room because everything from the cabinets in the kitchen are shoved into the guest room and it's all taped off. So we have two weeks to complete this project. Last minute tile for the floors, last minute countertops, last minute backsplash, a lot of last minute stuff. Hey, how are you doing? Good, I'm Joey. Joey, nice yeah. to meet you. I'm this Clark. Hi, Clark. Hi. Okay, Clark is here and he is our beacon of hard surfaces. We just hey. called in about the cement tile. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah. So basically... There it is! They're everything. It's everything I want. I spotted one right away that has tones of gray in it. So I knew that I wanted to incorporate cement tile into our kitchen and bathroom. It is an old school way of making tile, so it honors the sort of old world history of our house. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. That? What do you Mean. You just looked it up online? Joey, I'm a designer. Okay. I know things. So normally tile has a long gish lead time. We don't have time for a lead time. Yeah, we, we, we stock these. Okay. A lot of times when you're buying these materials in bulk, you have to order them with a lead time because they don't just have stacks and stacks of tiles. I'm taking it as a personal challenge to be able to find things that I love that are only available now. Most of these patterns are in stock. Really? Yeah, you could buy them today and pick them up tomorrow. This is a historical tile, so it's made all over the world. What they do is they create a mold from metal, and then they mix the individual colors, and they'll pour it into each slot by hand, let it dry and take the mold out, and then you have the encaustic tile. So the color goes down in about a quarter inch deep. These were made in Vietnam. Oh, wow. Yeah. Why is it called French encaustic heavy, tile? Heavy boat. It's, it's, it's part of the history of the tiles. Because I was looking it up that it that was really popular in England. It's, popular all over the world. We have an all English storybook house. <laughs> so I'm gonna play up the English popularity. Yes. I think Henry VIII liked them. I'm he sure. also liked women and had like eight wives, so. <laughs> We're not totally trying to be like him, but like, you know. And then I want that one, must, must. The that black one. And white one. Yeah, for yeah our no, bathroom. we're back ordered on that one. No! I am sorry. Clark! I know. That'll be in in September. That's too late. It's out of stock. Are you kidding? I'll go to Vietnam. Okay, so we'll send you Tonight. to Vietnam. Do you guys do countertops too? Yes. This is so pretty, this marble. This I really want beautiful. marble, but it's so expensive. We've always talked about how cool it would be to have marble surfaces in our place, but marble's so expensive, it's so temperamental. You have to maintain it, it can stain, it can etch. So it's better to go with the porcelain. Porcelain marble? Yes. It's imitation marble. But is it like small tile? No, no, they're big slabs. Ten, Shut up. 10 feet by five feet. Oh my God, I need to can see you? that. What? 
just... Your slab porcelain marble? This is revolutionary. Here, okay. Clark is telling us that there's this new stuff that is porcelain slab. I've never even heard of it. It's old meets new. It's perfect. Lead the way. All right. <laughs> I don't know why my glasses on. Oh my gosh, is this it? This is it. So it's a porcelain slab. So it's Porcelain slab, it's a quarter inch thick. Yeah, it's so thin. And you can use it for countertops? And use it for countertops. Wait, is this Calcutta? This is the Calcutta. I want that one. How is the durability compared to like quartz? Because quartz Str is the most. Stronger than quartz. This can even go outside. Up. Yes. <laughs> she is so loud. She's like pushing the sales guy. Who does she think she is? Would this work with undermount sinks? We you can do undermount sinks, but it's a little trickier. So well, we, have a, we have a we have a farmhouse sink for our kitchen, so that'll work. You can't do rounds really for yeah, a sink. No. You, yeah, you need a you need a square. But we already have the sinks. Uh oh, we did this backwards. We're from our mistakes, people. <laughs> I mean, I'm standing on it right now. So it's just fragile in like the, the fabrication, in not the fabric once it's installed. Strong. Perfectly fine. If Kate jumps up on the countertop. No top. problem. I mean, I don't jump, I'm not like, you know. <laughs> you could use your go-go boots, get up there, yeah. <laughs> well there, Clark! <laughs> oh, sorry. This is like a sacred place that you're yelling. It's not secret, why is it sacred? Look at it. Can we get this? Now? Yes. Fantastic. Done. Okay, moving huh. on. Floor. Floors. Awesome. Countertop. Done. Oh, you were cut from a mountain. I feel your energy. I'm getting kind of like a fake version of you, but one day, you and I will unite. Small mosaic, you for know, what? like for small. What, what for shape? The bathroom floor, hexagon. Hexagon. Oh, easy. It's right easy. here. So for the kitchen floors, I want to honor the tradition of hexagon tiles in the original 1927 bathroom in our house, bringing a little bit of a modern edge by doing a dark grout line. When you're a dirt ball like us, do a colored grout. It'll help you out. Joey, speak for yourself. No, you're a dirt ball. Joey, that's so mean. You're cute, small little dirt ball. Joey, you're my little dirt ball. No. Say that again. <laughs> this size for our master bathroom floors because I want to stay true to like 1927. I like all white of those. The tile in the bathroom is going to seamlessly go into the shower, whereas before we had a step up, now it's just a one flat surface, which is going to make the whole place feel a little bit nicer. Oh, wait, you have these in stock? It takes about a week to get those. Can you rush it? Yes. So you can rush it to how quick? We can, we can shake on that. I'll have it delivered to the job site tomorrow. Yes! Oh my god. How do we go from a week till tomorrow? Because he's like, paying for it? Oh. We're paying for it. All right. We're gonna have a full car. Can we check out? Let's check out, Let's Clark. Check out. We're, we don't got any time to spare. <laughs> All right, I guess I will be making some phone calls, finding another place in LA that has in stock black and white and caustic tile. Hi, I was just looking on your website that you have the Fez style and caustic tile. Do you have that in stock? Okay, amazing. Do you have the, there's like a black and white Fez. It's called Fez. I need like, like 104 square feet. It's for shower. You have it? <gasps> no, my gosh. Okay, I, I want to buy it like right, like right now. Okay, this is such good news, you guys. It's meant to be. There's this other place that has black and white encaustic French tile, which will be really cool with the mosaic tile that's going on the bathroom floor. Project tile and countertop done. I feel like this should be like the next jewelry collection. All made of these. Made of what? Eyebrow earring, tongue ring, septum. You're not even looking. We're just putting quick set down. You just use your trowel to make sure it's not just a big glob because you want there to be some air in between the little levels. Spacers. The spacers come in different sizes. We picked a bigger spacer around a 3 16 so that you'll be able to really see that gray grout in between. Oh yeah, that's that's plenty. Joey, I'm adding as I go. You put the dough on the floor and you give it a smearing. Now you take the thing with the comb side and you make a nice pattern. I'm better at this than Joey is. Let's look at the backsplash tile. Encaustic tile, they're hand poured molds and they pour the different colors of clay or in this case cement down into the mold. So the pattern like goes down rather than being a painted tile. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. And then in the 20s, they use mosaic tile. So we've got the old English and the 1920s when our house was actually built happening together. And then we're going to have the Calcutta porcelain on the countertop. Did you know that there was a freaking fly swatter right in here? Ew, it's, a, it's like, Flash. it's broken. Would have been helpful many times.
Well, instead of using a magazine when a fly comes in here. Ew, you use my magazines? We had the Poo Poo Palace, and we're gonna actually put an arch on this little walkway to make it match the arch theme that's going on throughout the house. We're gonna make a base cabinet where the litter is gonna go in, a nice countertop. The laundry machines used to share the Poo Poo Room with the cat's litter, but now we are moving those to the interior closet, so it's gonna be a really nice, chic laundry room on its own. All right, into the bath. Wow. Oh, oh, wow. What's happening? I know. You're, t you're sitting where the, you're gonna sit on a toilet. And look at the t the shower. How crazy is it that that's the old exterior wall of the house? Purple. We used to live in a purple house. All right, let's look at this tile. Very cute. Nice. Ah, it's so pretty. I love it when it's on the mesh too. Such an easy installation. These are the small hex tiles. They actually come in sheets, so you don't have to install each individual tile, which is really helpful. Classic floor tile. A classic mosaic. Like in the other bathroom, we have the mosaic. Yep. We have to go pick it up. I literally have called every single tile place. And this is more encaustic tile? Yeah. It's called Fez. Can you use it in a shower? Yeah, we have to seal it with a impregnating sealer. So you asked her if we can use that tile in the shower? Guys, I literally looked at this picture online and ordered them off the picture on the phone. Here's hoping they look good when they get here. It's gonna be a loud corner, but it'll be cool because like all of our fixtures and accent pieces are really cool pieces. So when you look into the shower, you're gonna be like, dang. Dang. Oh, you know what's gonna be so cool? What? Is the seamless floor. Yeah. The fact that like, it's just gonna be all one level into the shower. Yeah, versus we had that big step before. Yeah. You wanna come take a shower with me? Thank you, Joey. I already showered this morning. You think we'll both be able to fit in our new small shower? Rain head all up. Oh, it's gonna be amazing. I'm just gonna imagine shower because like, you make things happen by imagining them. Hey, it's small, but... Good things come in small packages, right? Oh my God, do they. <laughs> oh my God, and underneath it is like an ivory. And I want to go white with the house. The original color was like a white. No, no, -white. I want to go this color with the house. No. Or this color. No. We also have to get a window. The other thing that's happening in the bathroom is we are removing those two sad little tiny weird frosted windows that we're in. And we're gonna put a much bigger single window. Joey. Turn the water off. What? It's too hot. We're in the shower scene right now? Yeah. And I would get the body. Okay, get me. I'm washing hey, myself. Wash my back. Get that crack. Got it. Get it. Get that crack. <laughs> I feel very showered. Mm-hmm. Very excited about those floors. Mm-hmm. It's gonna be a cool. Can you take the glasses off, please? Mm-hmm. Okay, fine. I'm so excited about those tiles, and I'm really glad that we found the other encaustic tiles. I can't believe we got it all as quickly as we got it. I know. I mean, most people are waiting like months for that stuff. When you put your mind to it, you can do anything. Exactly. Like Including. subscribing to our channel. Oh! Good transition. And helping us being a part of our family. Yes. We're gonna try to get to a million subscribers by the end of the year. Someone's gonna win a $10,000 room transformation. Ah! With every new 100,000 subscribers, we'll donate a thousand to charities that help people find homes. And we're excited to bring you more episodes of OMG We Bought a House. Don't worry, we won't leave you out of any of this insanity that's happening. <sighs> Whew. All right, see, see you, you next, next time. time. <gasps> Ooh, that was good. Jinx, buy me a Coke. You don't drink Coke. Buy me a Hanson's healthy Na soda. natural soda. Ooh, lemonade. <sighs>